law whereby uh, there was 10 years that you could probably catch up with a defendant that would skip and now the they skip well, bail skip bail and it, the uh now the the law has has uh said that you have to catch them in two years so what that actually does uh donnie it gives it, it it's an attack makes you liable on, quicker liable quicker but it's an attack on minority business enterprise and that that that's the argument that's, that's going to be framed as we approach the general assembly uh, session coming up in 2014 because it's, dri it's driving minority business uh, out of uh, out of business mm. particularly in and property cash which is bail bonds mm. You know, Baltimore bail bonds people are going through a similar challenge. Well, a lot of, lot of a lot of this, uh, Donnie, focuses around the fact that we we need to understand what happens when someone goes to jail. When when someone goes to jail, the family go to jail with them because they're going to skip. There, there's a loss of economics. That's one. Another one is them phone calls, them jacked up phone calls. Oh, we got the Baltimore brew coming up next. Uh, I don't know if they, you've ever done a story on, on the bail bond scenario, but. Uh, the people had money in an account for a particular phone company. Yeah. And then overnight, they changed the service. And so any money you had in that former account is irrelevant. Exactly. It's gone. Exactly. And they took your money. Exactly. And what we what we do uh, different at, at Jesus Christ Bail Bonds and Jesus Christ Home. That's the bond. name of it? That's the name of my company. Jesus Christ Bail Bonds. Jesus Christ Bail Bonds. Man, you better put a phone number with that. I ain't trying to get no trouble. Say it again, please. 410-292-3029. Jesus Christ Bail Bonds. And our email address is Bishop Barry at bailout, bailout, bailout .com. That's very unique. Okay. Bishop Barry at bailout, bailout, bailout. Dot com. And we also have Jesus Now, that's Christ a Home marketing. Church. That's a marketing. Yeah, we also have Jesus Scott Christ Donner, Home you Church. ain't got nothing on you. You ain't got nothing on me. Uh, we also have Jesus Christ um, Home Detention, which is a private home detention monitoring agency licensed by the Department of Public Safety and Corrections. What we do different in the bail bond game, the home, home detention game, is that we partner with nonprofits in Baltimore that actually do uh, food drives, uh, uh, give, give um, we have a free clinic, Charm City Clinic, over at the Men's and Family Center. I and thought you was in PG County. County. No, no, I was doing a bail in PG County. Oh. Right. No, we're in Baltimore City. We're located at 2414 St. Paul Street in Charles Village. Wow. Okay. Wow. So we partner with the Men and Family Center, and we do a lot over there in East Baltimore. We just gave out two, three hundred. Oh, you talking about Leon Purnell? Leon Purnell, yeah. He sent you over here. No. I should have known Leon no. was in the midst of this. No, Leon didn't send He's a here. bully, man. Leon He's Purnell at the Men's Center. He, he's, he's not a bully when we when we give him enough money to take care of his ball. He's a bully for the community. <laughs> he need to be. <laughs> yeah. John's Hopkins just took everything over there. Oh, let me tell you about John Hopkins. John Hopkins fired a lady, uh, one of one of um, Leon's volunteers, and they fired her last summer. So I stepped in and took $25 and paid the rent for three months and then took the unemployment case, and now we have it on appeal down at the uh, Circuit Court for Baltimore City under judicial review. We, we, we have you ever been in Johns Hopkins? Oh, yeah, I've been in I'm talking about over there in Broadway. Exactly. How come when you go in there, it feel like you and Neiman Marcus? Because they just start following you all around. Yeah, exactly. You ever felt that feeling? I felt that feeling. It's like, dang, dude, I just came into the front door. Right. Man, they got three, man, they got, they, they, they call him plays. I was like, I'm never going back over here again. Who's, who's the man? They, they got like Ozzy Newsom up there watching the cameras. Black man on the left, black man. Scope him, scope him. That's how I feel, man. Like, like going in that company at Rice's Town Road Plaza back in the day. It's crazy up over there. But also, uh, uh, the issue uh, with the remission law is basically that that it's driving minority businesses out of business. How? And it's a, it, because if, if you have to, if you have to, um, Find digging. somebody in two years versus the previous law that was ten years, then you were never ready to recoup that money, and and then it, it, it weighs on the fact of keeping people out of jail so they can take care of their family. Now if they got to go to jail, they got to go to jail. But if they don't have to go to jail and they got running time, they still can set up provisions for their family before they have to be incarcerated. But also we have to deal in the black community the fact that we have to start hiring out people and we have to pick up the slack. When there's a problem in the black community, if not, all we're going to do is increase the crime and we should be increasing the peace. Black men make up 44 percent of America's prison population, and this is the most incarcerating nation on earth. And here you're trying to free some of these people, and you're saying you're getting challenges. Yo, I'm getting challenges, but I'm, I'm, I'm up for the task, Don. That's why it's called Jesus Christ Bail Bars. He can do all things. He can do all things. 
What's, what what are the bail bondsmen? Are, are you coming together? Yeah, I know there's been yeah. a meeting or two. Yeah, we're coming together now. We, we're understanding that, that um, we can no longer afford to be separate on any of the issues. We have to come together in order to make our, our voices heard, in order to challenge the power brokers, and 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 the one percent of people that can that control the, the the bail bond game, you know, in America, because our families, you know, and our loved ones are basically uh, slaves to an incarcerated system, and if we don't step out, then we all we're going to do is create a more of a generation of incarcerated people, and that's not going to work. See, there you go, trying to free all these black people, man, get them out of jail so they can dress and look nice like well, you. Well, 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 darling, I mean, we built the country for free. Our ancestors built the country for free. Now you're so, trying to get paid. So, so what else can't we have? The rest of the world should I've be I've been asked. asking the same yeah. thing. So how can people get in touch with you? Let's get that out uh, there. You can get in touch with me at uh, 410-292-3029. Bishop Berry. You got to say that nice and slow. There's some older people yeah. out there. She just found. Uh, she <laughs> she so just got the ink pen. 410-292-3029. One more time because she ain't found the paper yet. Yeah, 410-292-3029. Also, I mean, I'm, I'm the most famous bail bomb in the United States. You can ain't talking smack, me, too. Me How you the most famous check, bail bomb? Because my company is Jesus Christ Bail Bomb. Check me I out on YouTube. You know what? What? I'm on the college humor. I'm on how many hits? How many hits your, many your videos getting? Oh, they getting massive hits. I mean, websites. I better put coming. me in this video. You better put yourself in that video. That photograph might be worth something. Somewhere. I see. Stop playing. You on social media too? Yeah, Facebook. Absolutely. I'm ready to start a, a, a organization called Bishop Nation. We gonna get this uh, straight. Smack. Well, Omega Sci-Fi. Wow, to the bail bondsman, Bishop Byrne. Jesus Christ bail bond. Jesus Christ bail bond. Bail out, bail out, bail out. Dot com. Dot com. That's some marketing for you. Y'all better take some lessons. I'm taking some lessons.